What up guys, this is Pastor Cano again, we're coming up with another tutorial, another video in JavaScript and tonight we're going to be talking about function expressions. Yeah, uh, in previous video we already saw functions and, and we use a function declaration. There is two common ways to do a function and the first one, like I said, we use a function declaration previously which, which we use a keyword, the keyword function. And then we give a, a variable name. Uh, my function and then open and close the parentheses and then open and call the brackets and then inside right here it was your code your block of code right and this is called a function declaration okay now uh, function expression we have the following we use a keyword let and then there's a variable name which is going to call my fun so the function is going to be assigned to this variable. Yeah, we're going to use the keyword function and then open and close the parentheses and then we have curly brackets and then inside right here is going to go it's going to go your block of code. Like in this case I want to see show message and I want to say the following. Uh, I am here in this function expression. Okay? And then how do we invoke this function expression? So we usually invoke by calling the variable name my font, open close the parentheses and the semicolon, and then you save that and then refresh the browser and then it says the following, I am here in this function expression. Now you can also add a uh, function name to this function, let's, let's do message let's save it and this this still works right but what is going to happen if you want to call this function by the message by the function name let's change that message let's save it and then what we have it says right here message is not defined yeah basically we use the, the function name in this case in the function expression just just for debugging purposes, right? It's a lot easier to have a function name, so if we want to debug it, right? But uh, usually you're going to have in a function expression, you're going to be calling this function by the uh, uh, variable name. If we change that to my funds, and then that should work. Save it and then refresh it. Yeah, that work. And then you can just get rid of the name, save it. And it still works. All right. All right, guys. So thank you for checking the video. Uh, hopefully this helped you out. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Okay, have a good night. Okay, bye-bye.